Hello everybody, my name is Epa Fibson, and I'm going to show you how to capture chat on your Xbox One using a Windows 10 if you like to broadcast through open broadcast software and stream to Twitch or record gameplay. It's pretty simple. It's probably like maybe three steps. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is open up the Xbox application on your Windows 10 PC. Then what you're going to want to do is start a party over here and it let this lets you talk to people in a party on your PC to other people in Xbox Live. So another thing is you will also need a headset and a mic. So, and I'm currently using a set of Astro A50s. If you know how to hook up your Astro A50s to your PC and your Xbox One at the same time, there are videos out there for it. But you'll open that up, you'll start a party and you'll have people in it. Then you'll go to OBS and you can do this two ways but I'm just doing it one way is that I'll just use a window capture. You can set a window capture. So I already have it set up. Window capture, OK. And then you can set it to the Xbox app. And then you'll hit OK. So when you begin recording or streaming, it's not going to capture the actual window for reasons unknown. It will just black screen, but it still records the sound. That's what it looks like when it's recording the video. It's not going to show anything. It still shows the sound. Another big issue is that you'll have to test with a friend or something to make sure that the chat evens out, as in it's all synced up perfectly. I would ask my friend a question, and he'd answer, and I went back and listened to the video, and it would he would reply to me even before I finished the question. So you'll have to mess with that. And what you do for that is you'll go to Settings, audio and then mic sync offset millisecond. Now the second method in order if you want to record your party is that you can do it via the monitor capture way. I wouldn't recommend it because it's kind of a mess but you go to monitor capture and you just select it and it allows you to capture a monitor. The only benefit I would see of doing this is if you wanted to have your Xbox window open while you were streaming and you'd have it set so that it only blocked out a certain corner of the screen and you wanted to show who is in your party or whatever. I don't know why some people would like to do it, but I personally wouldn't recommend it. So that's all you really need to do. It's pretty simple. Thanks to Windows 10, you can now record your Xbox Live party chats and stream them without having to mess with cables or anything like that. So thanks. I hope this tutorial helps, and you all have a great day.